What is up guys? So today I will be teaching my brother how to shoot. I want this vlog to pretty much show how easy it is to learn how to shoot. Like even with zero experience, it's not as bad as it looks because it looks very intimidating and it could be like one of those things where you're like, oh my gosh, it's so scary. Like people talk about the recoil, people talk about this and that, but it's not as bad as it seems. Um, a little background of my experience. Uh, majority of my experience is from being in the military and I have shot expert on rifle and pistol in the middle of the ocean with the ship rocking. So your boy is no scrub. Before I get a bunch of comments saying like this and that, I'm not saying I'm an expert. I'm just saying that I know a thing or two about shooting. Before I kick off this vlog and show my brother's background and all that stuff, I wanna go over the four universal safety rules, just in case you're watching and like I forget to record me telling my brother this. So one, treat every weapon as if it is loaded. So that's obvious. Don't be doing, playing around with guns and stuff. Treat them like they're loaded, even if they're not loaded. Um, two, do not point at anything that you do not intend to shoot. So muzzle awareness, do not go around pointing your gun at random stuff. Keep it at the target. Um, three, keep your weapon on safe until you intend to fire. Safety first, always keep your gun on safe until you're about to pull the trigger. And four, oh, keep your finger off the trigger until you intend to fire. I blinked out for a second. I am so sorry, but I, I promise you, I know my safety rules. And with that being said, this is my brother pretty much telling you his background of shooting. What's my background? a 19 year old kid who's never shot a gun before I'm trying to get the experience nothing crazy have you held a gun i hold a bb gun mm -hmm. you know what i mean yo this sun kind of bright How you lose the ticket five seconds in? <laughs> I can't find it, bruh. All right, so I'm gonna cover the basics. So this is where your magazine goes, which is all your rounds. Uh, the Glock doesn't have a safety, but usually the safety would be around here. The trigger, the barrel, and your sights. Uh, when you're aiming, you want to have everything aligned pretty much flat. And whatever you're aiming at is like the tip, if that makes sense. So if you're aiming at something, it'll look like, like pretty much like this, and then the circle that's in the middle will be aligned with the two like football post looking things. I don't know how to use a speed loader, I'm not gonna lie. Oh snap! For the magazine, I put 10. Yeah, I put 10 rounds in here. So Seated. Um, for you to shoot, you have to hit this to release it. It's going to send it forward. And you sh that should put the round in the chamber. If not, then you'll have to rack it back. Um, when you're shooting, I told you how to align it. But you want to have your fingers or your thumbs like this, pretty much. Like, I'm going to show you, like, like this. And looking down the sight, the, the sight, and when you pull the trigger, don't flinch. Cause if you flinch, it's gonna like either make you shoot down or up. So just like do a smooth pull straight and keep your arms straight. Don't wanna pull it back too? No, just like, don't cross your thumbs. So keep this finger straight. <laughs> That's gonna give you probably the best support. Remember everything I said? Yeah. All right, so he said you can't do headshots if it's less than 10 yards, so aim for the X in the middle. And your first shot is going to be loud and it's gonna like be like shocking at first. But don't like because of that. Don't like anticipate the rest of the shots and like try to like flinch because it's gonna mess up your aim. Hit it! All right, then pull it back. One shot. 
I'm not gonna lie, this is way better than expected for your first time. Alright, so he got cocky, now he wants to try to do headshots. I think I did better than you. I right, all mine hit the top right. of the ball, so you're not gonna. All right, you got a little song. Cause I realized I was shooting low when I hit these three, and I was like, oh snap, so I went back up. Cause I was like, so if you don't aim like directly aligned, and this is slightly too low, it's gonna aim, aim down. So. All right, so try doing um, like two, Pause and then two because you have six, right? Yeah. Yeah. Try to shoot in twos. Like well, rapid. Huh? Like rapid. Well, it'll be like one, two. Instead of like shooting and then taking a long pause, like you could do one, two, pause and one, two. How do you feel after? It was an already experience. It was dope. First time, I think I did nine out of 10. You wanna show your paper? You wanna see amazingness? I'm not gonna lie, you you missed uh, a few shots. I mean, it was shots, the, the headshot from like, how, how many yards away? It's 10 yards. Like 10 yards. I missed two headshots, but it's all good. I'm right there, I'm right there, I'm right there. So that is how easy it is to shoot obviously practice makes progress and the more you practice the better you're gonna get but off of camera i only gave him like an extra maybe like five or ten minutes of training while we we're waiting for the lane and first time ever picking up a gun and shooting and he did pretty good to be honest so you shouldn't be intimidated to go out and at least practice or learn how to shoot if you're following the safety rules and some understanding of like how to aim, how to stand, all that stuff, it's honestly like the easiest thing ever. Um, I have a lot of people that I know that are like afraid or like, oh my gosh, guns are bad or it's so scary. It's like, we shot a Glock 19. Those guns don't have a lot of recoil, but still like first time shooting and he did really good. Like, comment, subscribe for more. Uh, leave some comments on if you think that I said something wrong or I guess didn't give enough training. I gave some training off of camera, so I don't want to be judged for like the training. But yeah, leave some comments below.